Alright YouTube, I'm just doing a video on the BT Accelerator slash iPlate which I received in the post like about four days ago um, Personally, I think it's crap I know it's worked for some people but the statistics show that it hasn't worked it, ha it hasn't worked for more people than it has worked for but Never mind, the thing they don't seem to understand, like, explain to some people who don't really understand what this is, is it's just basically a filter that just goes over the hub, like that, and it hangs out. Um, so, even though they say it can speed up your speeds and stuff like that, even the adverts say it can speed up your speeds by 1.5 megabytes per second, um, that will not speed up your speed unless you have a lot of... Um, extension wiring put through the main hub which is coming to your house so unless you have extensions or anything in your house this will make a difference then well, it's supposed to it could still let you down but it's meant to make a difference um, so if you don't this will do absolutely fuck all I mean I only got I got this for £1.20 as I'm a BT broadband customer Let's see there um, and I no, I'm not using this as the speed that I was getting with this on was um, I was getting download speeds was 24k which is absolutely terrible then upload speeds was a megabyte one megabyte upload speeds which was pretty good but then the download speeds was just absolutely pathetic so I set an engineer out and it turns out that the actual hub, which was in the kitchen on one of the previous videos, which you might see, was actually downstairs. Now I'm in a different room. Um, as you can see, this is a different room, which I'll do a video on. But um, the block says to me, these cause more problems than the solve. And he says to me, I should launch this. But I thought I could just maybe give it a bit to someone who might want this. Give it a go. Um, and the dude, I actually know the man from BT. So I can't say any names for his job reasons. He says these are pretty pointless, but he give me this is where my phone is. It comes through. Is it gonna say there? He put this on mine. This is the new one he says. There's a few versions to this, the AD ADSL. This is on mine. Version 1.0. Now he says there's other versions. This is a lot better than the the actual I played. This means you don't need any sort of wiring to come in. You can still have loads of extensions coming out of this one, as I do. I have one which goes downstairs. Um, it's not getting used at the moment, it's just in case we get Sky put in or some for Virgin Media. But um, this is a lot better than the iPlayed. It actually has like open rich business written on there. If you can see that. And uh, this one is a lot better than the iPlate. Um, there is also, he also tells me something, um, just short briefing is really, and that there will be a new launch on the broadband speeds, which will be going up by, well, right now, since I've had that added on, compared to that, I get 3 megabytes per second download speeds. He says in a few more months when BT have a fiddle with wires and stuff, I will start receiving up to 10 megabytes download speeds, which my line can can support. They just need to have a fiddle with the wires, so he says very soon this year they will be upgrading everyone's BT like speeds and stuff, so that would be pretty good. So this is the beat I played. If anyone would like this, let me know. You are more than welcome to have it. Um I've got everything with it, the little booklet and all the shit, it's more than one of them, but um, and also I'll do a video of the new room, um, it's a bit smaller, but it's a lot better, and I'll do reasons why I actually moved rooms, but uh, yeah, that's the BDI plate, um, let us know what you, what you think about the BDI plate, and if it has speeded up your actual connection speed, and if it has, do a, uh, if possible, could you do a video and show me? So um, thanks for watching my videos, subscribe, rate, and comment. Thanks.